Hey, worship leaders, pastors, and friends, just wanted to send you a special message here on behalf of Worship Team Training and Worship Team Training University. During this uh, season of COVID-19, the coronavirus, it's something that's been shaking all of us here. And as, as much as it's been for you, your family, and your ministry and churches, and we just want to let you know how we are in deep in prayer for you and what your family may be experiencing. Uh, we're praying for health. We're praying for healing. Um, we're praying for sustenance and protection and God's comfort. During this time, many of us have been facing a lot of fears and anxiety, but we want to reassure you that not only is our God in control and in charge, but He's the one working right through you. In spite of everything else that may be happening, our God is in control, and we know that. And it's easy also to know even that if God is still in control, how, can do I, how do I feel the way that I feel and why? You're only human to be feeling these feelings, and you're only human to question, and even to question God. Why is this happening? I think that's a very human response. But we want you to be assured that even though it may be a human response that we have, it's God's response to be faithful. We may have the human response to fear, but God has the response to give us faith. We may have the human response to say, I'm scared. God has his response to say, I'm here. So no matter what may be occurring in this moment, we can trust that God's mercies are new every morning. We get this from Lamentations chapter 3, verse 22 through 23. It says, Because of the Lord's great love, we are not consumed, for His compassions never fail. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. It goes on to say in verse 24, I say to myself, the Lord is my portion, therefore I will wait for Him. We trust God that even in the times that we wait for Him, we have the opportunity to be found by Him, to be comforted, to be loved by Him. So we ask that you share this message also with your friends and family and those who need to hear it because our God is real. Our God is very aware of what's happening. So we ask that you keep yourself safe, continue to serve your family, keep them protected, your church, as you do your live streamings, worship leaders and pastors. We pray for God's goodness and blessings to flow over you as you continue to communicate the message of hope that we all need to hear and we all need to be reassured. Know this, as Worship Team Training and Worship Team Training University, we are here to help walk with you every step of the way. If there's anything that we can do, please email me personally, brandon at worshipteamtraining.com and also brandon at wttu.co. And if you're interested in our at-home learning programs, we have our Worship Team Training University site right here. You can try us free for seven days by going to the link below, wttu.co slash ftr, and also, we're offering a great percentage off for you and your worship ministry by going to wttu.co slash join. We are here with you, worship teams, leaders, and pastors for the long haul. Let us know what we can do. Email me personally at brandon at worshipteentraining.com or brandon, B-R-A-N-O-N, at wttu.co. We'll see you very soon with new content to come. We love you, and we look forward to ministering with you right here at Worship Team Training and Worship Team Training University. <laughs>